Most times I would do like, let me just push her out. My name is Faith Olo, and she's my sister. Her name is Mercy Olo. She is 20 years of age. The whole thing starts when we say the diagnosis of the, the sickness when they call autistic, when she did about 10 years. So when from then my mom done the battle with her, my parents and other done the battle to take care of her, take her to private organization. No, you know easy, you no know easy for my mom, you no know easy for my dad. Carry her to different different places to see if they could feel secure. She did come, but when she wants something like this. She goes start her violence. She goes, no matter how you try to calm her down, she go try, she go destroy things. She go break things, she go destroy things. But when she don't destroy, finish, when she don't calm down, don't, as in they don't beg and beg and beg and beg. After a lot of begging, she go come and calm down. Then you go promise her and say, that thing when she make you, make her and destroy those things, so you go provide the thing for her. That was thing go make her calm down with that. My mom then, she gets a provision shop. She don't spend money where well where for, for her medication. They will say, ah, this will not be medicine, something will not be, go see kind of the school, the money to pay for the, the a special kind of school for data state, no easy, no easy. So the only thing can make my mom come fall into depression, before last year, then she can she can pass on, she can die. So after she died last year, nobody to to take care of her. My younger brother still in school. Then my dad, if they live on for my dad, my dad nine nine and she and my dad they stay. Then my dad don't go work for his normal also. Before he go come back, guys go they molest him, go they harass her, go they want val to 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 balance her like that, so the youth they come make me so come, they follow me, they stay for Lagos. If I start, because I know the kind of person when she be right from when she did from 10 years, then she don't they do like that. I don't think I say, ah, as I want to say, say uh, cope with her, as I go say cope with her, with my marriage, my husband are physically challenged to cope with time for Lagos. You know, good day easy. Because now see some more, some more things now they manage for the Lagos. But I can't see say, now my sister, I don't go feel leave them for, for, for them make men, they molest her, irresponsible people, come they take advantage of her. Now I can't see carry her. Full of body come Lagos with the airport. So people say, when see airports with transport, my dad see, gather money, so you take they transport her with us come back to Karan Kong Lagos. Mercy. Mercy. Okay, what do you want? I want to go to school. want to go to school. I'm really having a great challenge with her because Body, she's really a big body to me. She's a big body. A lot of things that she has destroyed. <laughs> but like I said, blood is thicker than water. Most times I would do like, let me just push her out. Let me push her to the street. Let me let me leave her in the street. Once she starts, 
Once she starts the destruction, once she starts the the it's not easy. But most I'll just I will still call her in once she's calm. She's really a big burden. For the past few days now, the thing don't pass, be careful. When they destroy things, stable for her, she break arm the door. And once she don't start her balance, the power in her, they triple. She they she they, they very, very powerful. Enough you hold her. She go beat me up if I try to fight back. She go beat me. My husband, it go, it go blow my house. The last one I happened to say, it blow my husband for, for nose. She used to uh, overpower me sometimes. And, uh, and if I make a tend of beating her, like to correct her, if she do, did anything wrong, she will like making a tend to fight back with me. So there was uh, this pa uh, particular day that uh, she beat up her sister when I came back from work. So I was now asking her, why did you beat your sister? And she carried a, a load that she wants to go. I said, where are you going? She said, she wants to go. I said, where are you going? The process of trying to remove the bag from her she pushed me and I, I used, she, 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 she pushed me against the wall and my nose started uh, bleeding. The challenges I have now is that to feed is a problem and she is always crying of going to school whenever she sees children going to school. And uh, I don't have a short amount of money. When we make a inquiry about the school, the amount was uh, really too much for us. Why you they beat me? And they beat your brother? You don't like her to just stay with us, me and your brother. You don't like her? You like her? So what do you want now? You won't go to school. So if they put you for school, you don't go destroy things again. You could do well for this school. <laughs>